Good morning YouTube, this is Puck. Well, today I installed an app, a program, because I'm working on a concept, I'm working on the Windows 11 concept, and um, I installed an app that I want to show you. This all is happening on the Windows 7, and here you can see it, this is uh, iPadium 2, it's uh, very nice. It's an iPad simulator, an iOS simulator. Even have a little app store here. But that is not my problem that I want to talk about today. I want to talk about iPadium and the and the spyware and the nonsense that it installs on your computer. And I'm a victim of it. I cannot get my money back because this is a free program. But uh, I already have it opened here for you. Control panel uh, programs and features so what we're gonna do is we're gonna try to delete some apps as you can see Groove, Grooveorio this is a, a spyware app taking over your browser and then you know it wants to change the start pen uh, the start page of your uh, browser so you know I want to uninstall it now so we're gonna run it on un unlimited and you can say this installation requires your browsers to be closed so in fact it's telling you go get a big one because you know my browsers are closed no browser is running here but still i can't uninstall this so this is spyware you understand and it comes with ipadian ipadian 2 so i thought i blocked uh, most of it but i'm stuck here with a problem so let's clean this up okay we're gonna also remove iPadian cause yeah it comes with too much rubbish I must see to how to find uh, a way to you know get the offline installer and then unpack it and then get iPadian out of it but then again <coughs> iPadian is not uh, it's not really uh, how you call it uh, interesting we're gonna we're gonna download Revo uninstaller and we're gonna see if I can you know clean it Revo will give you 30 days it's not so big 10 megabytes let's install it comes without spyware thanks to God well let me not talk too fast things change by day you know programs are being updated daily so let's see what's gonna happen this looks good Now you install Revo. Open it and find out that Revorio won't uninstall. Not the normal way and not the forced way. So how to fix? Let's first do an unsuccessful uninstall so you will understand what we will do after this step. So let's take a look and we look uh, in the list here and we see that the program Groovio, Groovio, or how it's called, is here. So now it's going to create a full registry backup, creating a system restore point. So it's worth buying a uh, Revo, especially these days, you know. In the past there were many other tools you know that could because i'm going to show you that Revo um is a very good uninstaller i think it's the best around there we go this is another one my pc backup here it wants to connect to the internet we're gonna say block and terminate I'm going to do it advanced. Okay. 
run see yes there's no open browse it's nonsense now we hit scan there we go so what we're gonna do here we can see them we're gonna select all see that this is all the rubbish that the that the program leaves behind yes select all yes finish okay but now the app is still here okay youtube welcome back well i uninstalled it and how did i do it well i booted up the machine in safe mode and then i went to my computer and I just went to uh, program files and to the folder Riverio and I just selected it and I just deleted it okay after I deleted it I started up Revo and I could do that in save mode so that's really cool thumbs up for that uh, Revo uh, I could just uh, start up my Revo and I did so as you can see here it's also gone out of the listings what did i do uh it was still there when i removed the folder i just selected it and did the uninstall and then it said uh something about the uninstaller blah -de blah not found or so and then i just scanned for leftovers and i just selected all and deleted them as you could see that i tried to do before but the program would never you know leave from out of the uh, program sections uh, or section and now uh, it was gone and you know I just deleted it and I think my browser is now completely clean because I also cleaned the memory the register so I think everything is just fine now I don't see no reason why you know it should not be good it also changed my browser it changed my my search engine you know let me see if it's still there no it's gone oh there it is Gruvorio. it's still there you see that it's still there maybe we must remove it just like this so Gruvorio, delete you ugly nonsense so and ball.com also delete I don't buy at you anymore. So that's it, peeps. So that's how to delete Grooveorio, and yeah, the iPadian will leave some some stuff behind. You can remove it from your list, you know. And uh, yeah, too bad. As you could see, iPadian, yeah, it looked good, but I think uh, Blue Stacks with uh, the iOS 8 uh, uh, desktop, or you call it uh, launcher. Uh, it's way better than you know than this thing called uh, iPadian not that I want to say that iPadian is not a nice piece of work but iPadian is in fact nothing more than uh, a Java build something that should look like uh, uh, iOS and uh, well you also need uh, flash for it it's built it's all built on flash it's just a flash operating system no big deal so that's it peeps i hope you uh, uh enjoyed this video and enjoyed this information and i'm sure if you did you will like this video and subscribe to my channel for more videos of all sorts